Hey everybody, welcome back to Live on Stage. I am your host, Lucio Fernandez. Muy buenas noches, señoras y señores. Bienvenidos a En Vivo y en Escena conmigo, Lucio Fernández. Esta noche sí que le tenemos preparado un show especial porque tenemos los, 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 los ganadores, los, los galardonados de los premios de artes de Union City. That's right, ladies and gentlemen, tonight we are bringing you interviews with some of the honorees from the Union City Artist Awards held every year. This year was the third year and we have some, an Emmy Award winning we have all kinds of people we have producers we have artists we have musicians we have everything and they're right here on live on stage y tenemos de todos ganadores los premios emmy tenemos productores pintores cantantes locos de todas las categorías let's start fooling around let's start messing around vamos a parar de este de este lío vámonos con el programa aquí check this out check this out judith guerra our correspondent nuestra correspondiente judith guerra con ustedes check, check this out people peace out come back to me later Hola queridos amigos, aquí me encuentro en la tercera entrega anual de los premios aquí en Union City. Vamos a estar con muchas presentaciones, muchas luminarias. Y bueno, aquí me encuentro las primeras personas, por favor, vengan hacia acá. Hola, saludos. Come you too. <laughs> the same time. <laughs> yeah. Ok, ¿tu nombre es? Edgar González. ¿Y tú? Dougie Salomón. Ok. Ellos son dos uh, personas muy importantes en estos momentos aquí en Union City. Habla un poquito más de ti, Edgar. Bueno, soy economista y músico. Me crié en el pueblo de Union City y recientemente estamos emprendiendo un proyecto para el desarrollo de las artes, de la música y la producción aquí en Union City. Wow, eso es muy importante para nuestro nuestro aquí en, en Union City. And what about you, Doggy? Tell uh, me about. Me. I know, I know, stay. You know, stay. <laughs> I know you don't. You don't. Maybe you don't think a little bit, but tell me a little about about yourself. Okay, uh, my name is Doug Salomon. I'm currently president of Ronaldo Custom Guitars. Ronaldo's been constructing guitars in Union City for the last 50 years, and through Edgar's hard work, we are now expanding into a 3,300 square foot uh, manufacturing facility, and we'll be providing uh, northern New Jersey and the world with fantastic fine quality instruments. Wow, this is a phenomenon. Y bueno, dígame un poquito, eh, sé que tengo tengo un conocimiento de que usted va a recibir un premio hoy. Sí. ¿Cómo se siente recibir ese, ese galardón? Imagínese, yo he criado acá, en este pueblito, y después de muchos años regreso y me están honrando de esa manera, es para llorar. <laughs> Casi no, porque es un gran honor, sinceramente. Bueno, muchas gracias. Thank you very much for staying Thank here. You. Nice to meet you too. Y bueno, señores, aquí, oh, aquí seguimos en Live on Stage. Bueno, señores, aquí me encuentro con otra luminaria más de hoy. Él es Domenico Caro. Domenico, cuéntame cómo te sientes al estar aquí hoy, aquí en estos primos de Union City. Oye, no vea, estoy a tres cuadros de mi casa y aquí contento porque hace, no hace como dos meses que hicimos un espectáculo aquí, cerraron la calle y lo hicimos aquí. No, no, fue adentro, fue adentro y fue una cosa espectacular. Vale, cuéntame, yo sé, eh, tengo escuchado por ahí que vas a recibir un premio hoy. ¿Verdad? ¿Cómo te sientes? Así? No he dicho nada, es silencio. <risa> bueno, gracias, gracias, pero a mí me, me parece muy bien, ¿no? Que un, flame, un cantador flamenco, y yo tengo, me dan el premio porque tengo cara dura de cantar flamenco siendo de Rincón, Puerto Rico. Bueno, siempre parecen esos mix así. Bueno, cuéntame un poquito más acerca de tu cantador y todas esas cosas de, de, de flamenco. Yo quiero saber porque me encanta, me fascina. Pues mira, yo aprendí a cantar flamenco porque me iba por Andalucía. Cuando yo tenía 15 años, me fui por Andalucía buscando el cante flamenco. Entonces, encontraba que, mira, yo me iba por un callejón y de lejos escuchaba yo cantar flamenco. Y cuando me, acerca, me acerqué a la granja, estaba un hombre ordeñando una vaca cantando flamenco. Y a mí me pareció eso genial, porque yo andaba buscando flamenco y me dijeron que los camareros, las camareras, la gente del pueblo canta flamenco. Entonces así fue lo que pasó, ¿no? Que yo me fui a España buscando el cante flamenco porque no hay academias para eso. Yeah. Me parece fantástico todo. Bueno, ¿tú nos quieres dar un saludito aquí a Live on Stage? Oye, pues sí. Eh, francamente, no sé, francamente no sé qué decir porque de verdad que esto es muy bueno. Uh, 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 live, live on stage, quiero decir que Lucio Fernández es una persona genial, tiene mucho arte, tiene en España decimos, tiene mucho aje, en España decimos tiene mucho aje. Lucio Fernández, muy agradecido, muchas gracias. Vale. 
Bueno, señores, aquí me encuentro con Ardash. Ardash, ¿cómo te sientes hoy aquí en la entrega de estos premios de Union City? Ok, muy bien. He feels very good and he's happy to be here. Okay, so uh, it's wonderful, right? So tell me, tell me a little bit about yourself. You know about the the, the what, what do you do in this moment? Um, So he's, he's now 92 and he's here and he's being honored because Lucio nominated him, Lucio Fernandez did. He is the original creator and designer of all the world's championship boxing belts. So all of the belts, the sculptures that the champions get on TV, he created 40 years ago. Wow, this, I'm, I'm so proud of you, right? Because you are amazing, man, all right? Thank you. At 92. Of course, they're too young, too young. Anyway, <laughs> thank you. <laughs> thank you, thank you very okay, much. Okay? okay, thank you. Hi, Jim, how are you today? Fantastic, thank you very much. Tell me how you feel here in this award, a Union City Award. I'm honored and uh, humbled by it all. Um, I'm glad to be back in Union City and I'm ecstatic to see that the arts community is really blossoming here. We're going through this renaissance here in Union City that is just amazing. We've partnered up with Sartank, um, we've partnered up with the Hudson Exploited Theatre Company, Iati Theatre, and all of it's coming together here, um, as well as the Mayor's Office, Lucio, Mayor Stack. Um, these men and women have made making movies and television here exceptionally easy. So we're looking forward to making more projects with Lucio Fernandez and Saulo Diaz and Mayor Stack and all of our partners and friends here. It's, it's a really exciting time to be here. Of course, absolutely, yes. Okay, thank you very much to stay here and enjoy this award, okay? Thank you. Thank you. Y aquí me encuentro con Eric Crossman. Eric, how are you doing tonight? Wonderful, it's a pleasure to be here. Of course, tell me a little bit about the award you have today, an award. Tell me about Well, I haven't received it yet, so I'm not exactly sure, but... Well, this is a surprise, so please, but, you know, don't, oh. say, don't say nobody. <laughs> <laughs> no, I, I, I've been living in Union City now since 2006, and I've performed many concerts here. Uh, and it's, it's, a, it's a pleasure to uh, share my music with the the community and uh, uh, along with concertizing all over uh, I'll be I'll be performing in Korea this summer and uh, some other concerts all over the United States do you want to say something but you know this a little of uh, the, the the community in this moment right because some some kids especially the kids the young people they want to uh, like uh, learn music tell me a little bit about what do you think about this I think that studying music for young people is extremely important. Uh, I, I teach all of my four children to play music and I've also donated my services to their school, Rudra Wilson, uh, to form a little chamber orchestra that I did for almost two years and uh, I really feel that Um, it would be great if, if there was more funds available for uh, public school music programs and specifically I, I focus in the orchestral uh, classical music department. So uh, I, I, I think it's important for young people to be exposed to great music and uh, the more we can do that, the healthier our children will be and the more Uh, artistically uh, rounded, well-rounded they will become. Well, thank you very much and enjoy it tonight. Y aquí estoy con el aclamado Miguel del Valle. Miguel del Valle, el señor bajista, muy importante, ¿cierto? Eso dicen, eso dicen. <laughs> Cuéntame la nominación que tiene usted en estos momentos. Uh, bueno, la dominación que me dan es por la estrategia de tantos años en el arte de la música. Eh, desde muchachos nos criamos en esta área y estuvimos en varias organizaciones, varias bandas eh, locales. Y bueno, eh, llegamos a adultos ya y todavía seguimos luchando. ¿Tú estás trabajando con la comunidad aquí en Union City o, o qué, qué exactamente tu labor acá? Uh, bueno, mi labor aquí, yo soy uh, dueño de un negocio de automecánica. 
Eh, ya llevo desde el año 82 trabajando en el taller en Central Avenue, en Union City. Pero a la misma vez sigo haciendo mi musiquita con, con los músicos locales de aquí. Eso es muy importante. ¿Y qué usted le recomienda a esta juventud en estos momentos que ellos quieren aprender? Por ejemplo, por ejemplo en este caso suyo, Baja Bajo. ¿Qué usted le, le recomienda a esta juventud? Yo, bueno, yo le recomiendo a la juventud que aunque quieran ser abogados, quieran ser doctor, lo que quieran ser en la vida, siempre es bueno aprender un instrumento sea piano, violín, el instrumento que, que le llame la atención, porque eso es una terapia y es un arte, es algo que le va a ayudar al concepto de la vida, de ver las cosas en diferentes formas. Definitivamente. Bueno, muchas gracias y siga disfrutando de esta noche. Encantado. Muchas gracias. Ok, señores, aquí me encuentro con John D. Amor. Welcome here tonight. Thank you very much. Jay. Yes. How you feel tonight? I feel great. It's wonderful to be here. It's always wonderful to come back to Union City. I know. I heard like you born in Union City, right? Yes, I was. Okay. Yes. Tell me a little about your book because I know I love this. I, I love reading, right? Yeah. And somebody told me your book is was wonderful. Thank you very much. It's called The Boss Always Sits in the Back, and it's a story about some guys from Hudson County, primarily Bayonne, Union City. Sea Caucus and some things they did during the mid 1970s that led to one of the greatest scams in Las Vegas and changed the laws in America about gambling. Interesting. Tell me a little bit about because tonight you have a nomination, right? Yes, I do. Okay, tell me how you feel. It's an honor. When they contacted me and told me that I was up well, that I was up for this award tonight, I felt very honored. And I'll tell you why. It's, this isn't just my first award that Union City gave me. About two years ago, on, Mar on May 24th, 2014, upon the release of the book, Mayor Stack and Lucio Fernandez saw to it that Union City made a proclamation naming May 24th John D. Amor Day in Union City. So to have a whole day named after me in the city I was born in, It's the greatest honor, and I live in Los Angeles, so every year now for May 24th, I come back just to hang out in Union City on that day. It's wonderful. All right, thank you very much to join us. So welcome everybody, welcome to the third annual Union City Artist Awards. This night, tonight, is about the artists. It's all about the artists. Celebrate the wonderful, wonderful contribution, the wonderful careers that you guys have had. Uh, there are many awards outside, uh, many awards out there, We believe this word is super special because it really, really comes from the heart. It really aims to honor those people that need to be honored. Some people have never been honored. Some have multiple uh, honors. However, with that said, we want to honor the folks who uh, have come out of Union City, who reside in Union City, who've done wonderful uh, things with their career, uh, and who are inspiration to the residents of Union City now, and most especially our children. Uh, It is uh, 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 such an honor to honor you tonight because uh, every single person that's being honored tonight is so deserving and we are so grateful. And that's my son telling me to shut up. <laughs> and we believe you are so deserving. And yes, you could have won a Grammy, you could have won an Emmy, a Tony, uh, an Ola, an Ace, whatever. Uh, however, the Unicity Artist Award, it really comes from the heart. The mayor, the commissioners, uh, a small committee that we put together to uh, find the artists that we're honoring tonight. We painstakingly choose these people uh, with, with real seriousness to honor people who really, truly deserve it. Uh, and that's what we aim to do here. So it's not just a plaque, it's not just flowers that you're receiving, it's what that plaque and those flowers mean. It means that you have had an illustrious career. It may have been a short career, but it has been an illustrious career. You've uh, accomplished so many things, and you are, and you serve as an inspiration to, to each and every one of us, uh, and we're in awe to you. So to all of you who are getting uh, an award tonight, once again, a big hand, a big applause. Thank you. Brevemente, para no aburrirlos, eh, hay muchos premios, hay muchos uh, galardones que se dan, pero de todo corazón nosotros escogemos los comisionados con el alcalde y un comité que tenemos, eh, escogemos las personas que estamos eh, otorgando este galardón con mucho, eh, mucha seriedad, con mucha sinceridad, con mucho corazón. Son personas que pensamos que han laborado por muchos años y que han logrado grandes cosas, que han vivido en Unicid, en Unicid trabajado en Unicid, 
o que han aportado a la comunidad de en las artes y que hoy en día sirven como ejemplo para no solamente para nuestra, eh, nuestra ciudad, sino para nuestros niños, que son sumamente importantes. Así que este el galardón no solamente es una placa, no solo es una flor que usted está recibiendo de todo corazón, de todo corazón le estamos dando un premio porque nosotros pensamos que ustedes se lo merecen, se merecen ese premio y mucho más. Y esperamos que sea de su agrado esta noche y que pase una noche muy bonita. My congratulations and keep up the good work. Thank you. Um, for me, it's a great pleasure. Uh, being a mother of two and seeing my kids love the music and love the, love the art, I'm so happy that Lucio is able to create it to bring this to, to Union City. Uh, my kids were able to participate in this program, in the Great City pro uh, program, um, by dancing. My daughter loves to dance. And she tells me all the time, Mommy, when are you going to take me back? I wanted to learn how to do salsa. So, Lucio, thank you for bringing the art to Union City. Thank you for bringing the art to our kids. And thank you to Sposing Union City, to these beautiful, beautiful people that are here tonight. I love you. Congratulations. And have a great night. Anyway, so we're ready to begin the awards. Are you guys excited? Seriously, we do thousands of events in Union City. And this is my favorite because we get to honor our own. Both honored, thrilled, and humbled to be here. Uh, we believe it's a really exciting time to be here in Union City. It feels like the city's going through a renaissance. Um, our partners at Hudson Exploited Theater Company and at Sartank um, have helped us realize some really amazing dreams. Couple that with the extreme support of City Hall, it looks like it's a time to really make movies and television here in Union City. So HexTC, Sartank, IATI, and City Hall will be bringing a lot of projects here, hopefully putting a lot of people to work and uh, keeping me employed. <laughs> Thank you for this honor. I'm very honored to be uh, given this award tonight uh, in the city of where I've grown up and where I still live. And um, first and foremost, I thank my mom and dad for their, all of their support for my career. Um, I've also brought up two children in this city who have gone on to do very well in the arts. And, uh, and thank you to the board and the mayor um, for, and Morris, thank you for nominating me. Um, it it's a lot of hard work and dedication that all of us as artists and or um, for me, behind the scenes, as a producer and an engineer, um, a lot of work and hours and time that we put into it. And I recognize that in all the people that have been up here tonight. And I look forward to continuing my involvement with the school here. I speak at Union City High School um, every year and uh, just encourage people to participate in the arts in whatever way you can and uh, keep going forward and enjoy. Thank you. Thank you very much. Thank you very much. Uh, it's very flattering to be here with so many talented artists. Uh, I started uh, with my brother and Phil and on 8th Street and New York Avenue in a tenement in Union City and uh, from there I'm here now and it's been fascinating. Uh, I wish my mom and dad were here to see this. They would, my dad especially would have gone crazy. He was born on 9th Street in Union City. But it's been wonderful, Lucio, Mauro, uh, helping with the video and things. I wanna thank my wife. She's been my right hands for the last 31 years and I couldn't do anything without her. So thank you all and, and thank you very much. This is quite an honor. Thank you so much. Oh. And I was raised in Union City, biggest little city in the USA. This award is not just for myself. It's for all the musicians from Hudson County. All the younger, the young guys, some, some of them passed away, some of them are still alive. Most of them are retired, but this is for them. I'm very honored to be here tonight to receive this award in my hometown. I was raised on 20th Street, across the street from the restaurant, where everybody walked their dog. <laughs> <laughs> it's amazing to be here tonight to see this cultural revolution 
that's happening in my hometown. I never would believe this is possible, and you have made it possible, and the mayor has made it possible. And um, I'm thrilled to play a small part in it. Thank you so much. Well, it's a great honor to receive this from Union City, and thank you, Lucio, for your support in my musical endeavors. It's, it's been a great honor to share my music with, with Union City, and I, I, I feel very lucky to live here uh, since 2006. And I, I would have to say that without my parents instilling a love of of great music and, and teaching me the violin from a very young age, I certainly wouldn't be standing here today. And of course, my, my wife, Lita, who accompanies me in my recitals and supports me in everything I do, and my children, my four children, who inspire me and I teach them the violin and the cello and, and music whenever I can. <laughs> so thank you so much, I'm deeply honored Lucio, I have to agree with you. Margie is a better looking commissioner, but you're a close second. Um, and I have nothing but the highest respect for the mayor and the commissioners, but before I thank them, I'd like to ask my mother, Peggy Davis, to stand up for a second. Hoboken for 24 years and they never recognized my work and I've come here for two years and you have, I clearly should have moved here 20 years ago. <laughs> but um, thank you very much for this. Thank you commissioners and please thank the mayor. Um, I adopted or a little dog adopted me about two years ago and she and I, her name's Miami because that's where she adopted me. Um, she and I go out every morning from six to eight and we walk the streets of Union City, and I see a tremendous amount of beauty in Union City, and I think a lot of people overlook it. And I think if you just take a look around the room at some of the photographs, maybe you'll slow down a little bit when you're walking around the city and enjoy it as much as I have. So um, to the commissioners, to my new friend who I owe cafe con leche, and I promise it will come soon. <laughs> coming tonight. Thank you. Thank you. Unfortunately, Ronaldo could not be here to uh, accept this wonderful award. He, he deserves it totally. I agree. Um, I don't know what to say except for thank you very much for recognizing him, and I know he does appreciate this. Thank you. Thank you very much. This is very nice. Thank you so much. I was really surprised when he actually asked me to attend this, and I really appreciate it. Thank you. Thank you. Which I have been listening the entire time. Um, I did. I landed on 9th Street in Bergeline Avenue. I went to St. Anthony's. Um, but, you know, the one thing that I think is the really important thing, and it, it, nobody has actually said it, and I want to thank the commissioner and... Um, the mayor and just the city for doing this is that the art is really important in schools. Um, I was really lucky um, to have them. I have music and art and sewing and you know things that um, um, unfortunately our children don't have and it's a really important thing to open your mind and um, thank you guys for doing this and, and bringing it to the light, because it's really, really important. So thank you for doing this, and I love that it's coming out of Union City. Um, that's really all, I'm just glad, and if anything that I can do to help um, be an ambassador for the arts in this town, I would love to do it. Thank you so much, guys. What a night that was, wow. Red carpet, live music, people
people dressed to a T. It was a great event. Sí, tremendo evento. La alfombra roja, la gente vestida bonita, música en vivo, refrigerio. La pasamos de maravilla. Tremendas estrellas. That's right. It was, it was an incredible evening honoring the very, very best. It was great. It was terrific. And we had them right here on live on stage. Anyway, people, I gotta go because the producer's cutting me off. The director's cutting me off. I gotta go. My wardrobe stinks. I gotta go. I can't take it anymore. Till next time. I am your host. Oh, be before I say that, www.luciofernandez.com luciofernandez.com I gotta go, people. Stop messing around. Stop keeping me here. I love you guys. See you next time. Till next time, I am your host, Lucio Fernandez. Goodbye, everybody. Peace out, baby.